Hi guys, Mike here from uh, the sing, sing Alongs and um, uh, from the impending Gigathon tomorrow on Saturday the 8th of August, 10am. Um, uh, this is an instructional video to uh, talk to you guys about uh, any other guitarists out there or anyone who uses their hands a lot um, for their work um, to, to just share with you some of the things that I do kind of before a gig um, to sort of warm the hands up and, and forearms and stuff and um, a little bit of kind of massage and stretching um, that, that really helps with, with uh, you know, when you're about to play some music. Now, um, I've never done a 12 hour gig before, um, so I might have to do a few stretching sessions and keep the blood kind of going and, and sort of, you know, stretch out the muscles and stuff. Um, so you might see some tomorrow if you're watching, but this is this is what I'm going to be doing uh, tomorrow morning. Um, and yeah, as I said, maybe, maybe um, every now and then uh, throughout the day. So first of all, you want something to kind of soften up the skin and make it a little bit hydrated. So this is just some um, argan oil body, body butter stuff um, because you're going to be doing a, some light kind of massage and that's pretty hard on, um, it's hard to do on, on, on dry skin. So just kind of give yourself a bit of a, um, a, a moisturizing on your forearms. I know it's not necessarily um, fashionable for men to do, but you know, whatever you if you if you've got an opinion on that then um uh, whether men should be using moisturizer or not uh, then you can keep it to yourself um so the um it's very useful for this for these purposes so the next thing um you want to do is the i mean you, you, you're in your hand you've got two main muscle groups you've got your the muscles that control your thumb and go up that way and then you've got a muscle that comes up there I'll come onto your fingers in a minute. So, um, as a guitarist, if you're holding the, the, the whichever um, hand you hold the neck with, uh, the muscle on that um, um, palm under that thumb is probably going to be quite tight and quite strong because that's where you put most of your your kind of pressure. Um, but those two areas need to be just um, gently massaged, and you know, we're, all we're trying to do here is get. Um, get blood flowing to the, these these muscles and get them um, soft and um, and kind of limber you know and, and stretched out and warm um, for what you're going to be doing um, again this isn't just guitar this could be any kind of manual stuff that um, someone does any or any other instrument um, so once they're a bit kind of warmed up I'm, I, I, I'd spend longer on these normally but this is just to show you guys what I do um, uh, so the, yeah once these these main kind of muscle groups are nice and nice and toasty nice and warm you can then move on to a bit of massaging your fingers um, now the muscles that control your fingers are actually kind of all attached around here so when you move your fingers you can see on my forearm there that ripple right there that's your finger muscles moving okay so in order to to massage them and make them feel nice and nice and warm and, and and supple you need to be massaging your forearm so again we're not looking for it's not like a deep tissue sports massage or acupressure or anything it's just a gentle kind of you know rubbing out with your thumb just keeping it getting the muscles warm um getting them ready for what you're going to do um if you come across a, like a tender bit then just give it a little bit of attention um, just kind of roll it out um, make it feel good all right um, and then um, you know you, you're getting the blood going to to that area and the blood will and your circulatory system will kind of do its its, its job of cleaning it out and, and making it feel good okay so now on to some um, finger um, massage itself so the I, I love these bits um, you know as a guitarist your fingers are uh, kind of in use quite a lot um, and they you know they, they need a bit of attention so uh, what I do is generally kind of just just rub them out towards the tip so from the kind of knuckle all the way down um, and now you're not looking to kind of pop your, your your knuckles here or anything it's just to get the blood flowing as i said to those those areas um, and make them feel nice and warm and once you've done that for a bit you can you can roll your fingers so if you just get your get your finger and and, and thumb from your opposite hand and just kind of roll the joints so again you're just going up and down you're getting blood going to those joints um, and it's hopefully doing its job um, clearing out all the um, unwanted kind of byproducts of general life <laughs> that kind of accumulate in these things um, cod liver oil very good for musicians um, on advice I've been taking that for for about six months now and I did have the first signs of some, some um, arthritis building up in that um, index finger it's gone away now so that's pretty cool anyway so that once you've done your fingers and that's pretty much all the the, the kind of the massaging that, that you want to do um, or that you need to do on your arm forearms and hands 
and fingers you can go on to the stretching okay so one of the simplest stretches you can do um, is just making a fist like kind of clenching it quite tight then opening up and doing like a kind of rah, tiger style kind of um, tiger claw type type thing okay so just kind of um, holding it there for a little bit and then gradually put pulling your fingers out and kind of stretching them out um, as far as wide as they can go but again this shouldn't be high impact it needs to be nice gentle smooth movements um, otherwise you, you risk yourself uh, risk doing yourself some damage so once that's all done we can start stretching your forearm muscles out so one of the easiest ways to do to do that is to put your arm out get your fingers there and just bend it back okay so it's not a competition of how far you can bend your fingers back it's just to kind of stretch these muscles out here okay so you should feel it down your palm and down um, that bit of your forearm so you do that a, a couple of times on each now after i've done any kind of stretch whatever it might be maybe whether it be on my arms or wherever i always kind of give it a bit of roll out afterwards to kind of um, loosen off um the, the the stretch a bit but that might just be me it feels good to me but, but you know that might just be me so once you've done that you can then also do um do it this way so do like an individual finger stretch again you're not looking it's not a competition stretch you're not trying to be a contortionist you're just trying to get these muscles and tendons nicely um stretched out warm um and limber and supple and ready to to rock really and that's the point of all this you know, it's, it's getting ready to rock and getting ready to do whatever it is you're doing okay so once we've done that um you can do it the other way as well so you can stretch your wrist down so um uh, wrist pointing down fingers pointing down towards the floor like that and just gen very very gently pull your wrist down um the other thing you can do as well forgot to mention the massage bit just now you can gently massage your wrist joint because um, that's going to take a bit of a pounding uh, if you're playing uh, an instrument you know use your wrists and your hands a lot um, so getting some some a good bit of circulation to them is good as well another thing you can do um, for a stretch is to do like a prayer position so you're like this and then just gradually lift your elbows up so you're kind of in that in that sort of position like that and just gradually lifting your elbows up and then you should feel a stretch kind of down here and all the way around to your to your fingertips um so apart from just kind of doing a bit of a, a break dancing a bit of caterpillar every now and then um and kind of stretching out and making sure you're nice and open um in your chest so stretching your shoulders back um you know a lot of people tend to spend their life kind of hunched up like this looking at computer screens and and stuff or whatever they're doing or at a desk but you know we need to be nice and open especially if you're singing you need to you need to have everything kind of open and, and free to move um so um so yeah i mean that's just kind of kind of what i do um uh, as i said i'll be doing it tomorrow morning but a bit for a bit longer and i'll be doing it probably you might see me doing some some stretches if you're watching at that time uh, during the the, the the event tomorrow but the idea is that you know if you're going to put your body through any kind of exercise um you need to be stretching out you need to be making sure that everything is is warmed up and stretched out um so a you, you avoid um any injury as much as possible but b everything's working nice nice and efficiently there's lots of blood going around um, to the bits that you need um and you know it should make the job a little bit easier or hopefully a lot easier anyway that's it for me and just thanks to penny from penny post for suggesting that i do this video um it was a great idea and i've had a lot of fun uh, doing it just now so hopefully i'll see you guys tomorrow all the best bye